Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh A cikin wannan video insha Allah zan muku bayani yadda zaka yi comparing two set of data domin ka extracting information daga bulk data in zuwa separate data a cikin excel abin da nake nufi shine data ce za a baka mai yawa so wannan data da ake baka mai yawa sannan kuma akwai other data daban da aka baka wanda ana bukatar information na wannan other data i extract nation from bulk data in da aka baka misali yanzu zaku ga cewa muna da wannan data in muna da record about um, 78000 records ni anan wuri za ku ga sannan muna da over 78454 records dai da ce wadda tana da staff codes first name so name other name date of birth gender marital status da sauran su so this whole information na su ake bukatar i extracting anan sai aka baka wannan staff codes din ga sannan sai aka baka wadannan staff codes din da kuke gani mutun 20 um let's see 20 da nawa mutun 33 da uku aka baka staff codes na su so ana su i extracting information other informations na su duka anan out of uh uh, uh one number bulk data in the accurate so one machine is top codes in su one number machine a uh, main data in the accurate man i extracting informations in nasu a cikin a uh, nan worin ya dawo ne ya kasance akwai information nasu duka complete na. so shine abin da zamu insha Allah a uh, cikin wannan uh, video so domin ka yi wannan abin da kake bukata farko um shine kana bukatar ka dora uh, headings in the suke a cikin wannan data in kamar haka muna da wannan staff code first name so name har zuwa phone number so just copy this heading first ka zo nan kai paste na shi a nan wurin so wannan shine abin da zaka yi number 1 kenan so number 2 the next thing you are going to do shine ka yi highlighting ka yi highlighting column din da zaka sanya data na ka ciki so just ka yi highlighting duka so ga nan kai highlighting duka so the next thing da zaka yi apply shine ka danna equal sign shine ka danna equal sign so idan ka danna equal sign the first thing da zaka da formula da zaka aiki da ita ce formula da ake kira index just zaka yi click index sai ka danna open bracket so now what it will ask you for shine are it will ask you for are so make sure you go back to this and take the whole are here that is the whole data here just take it all and lock it by clicking um f4 just click f4 and press comma the next thing you need to put is the row number so the row number you need is to get is to apply match function or for you to get the row number because you don't have the row number you need to get the row number by using match function so say karu buta match say ka open bracket what is the look up value me kake nima value inda kake nima shine wannan shine is a stop code so just click on it as stop code just click on it say ka comma just click comma Okay so what are you looking at look up are look up are in mona stop shine uh stop codes in mo so we'll come and take the are one and then we lock it with f4 say mo kara dan nami say mo dan na comma so to finish this uh formula we need to put exact match we put zero then we close bracket we are not done so the next thing we are going to do is to put comma then we need to apply match again we open bracket what are we looking for in this now we are looking for this uh uh uh, uh, uh first name that what we are looking for so just click on this first name click on it and you lock it but what you need to lock 
is not the column you need to lock the uh it's not the uh the uh, the column is this uh, row so just remove it so now if we drag it now it will change the row uh the column but not the row so we want it to stick on row one that what we need only so now when you put this then you put comma what is the lookup array the lookup array is this and then some other got you are the lookup ID she knew one and headed in the market she so just highlight this up till phone number and lock it and you press comma what do you need for match then is zero then you close it and you close another uh, a close bracket so let me explain this formula for you first of all you take the index you are indexed you take the 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 uh the entire array of the data that is from this to from this up till this up till the end you highlight the 78,000 data all of it so now you come here you come here now again instead of you to get the row number secondly apply match match it is that about a row number in camera it is that about a row number so you applied your match second okay sell naka look up value naka which is this second okay look up value can you come out that naked okay look up are in a kashima secret lock in nash so and then she makes a exact match by and kagama the one that look up in the match now for who say can you match maybe one day can i like other columns she the column number like a key name i think i'm part of the match in order for you to get the column number in the zika umaka so since we apply in the data dika and then dika we apply in nash it's an amway highlight is so the next thing you are going to do is you need to lock this uh look of value you need to lock this look of value you need to lock it but the only thing you need to lock is a is only a you need to lock now don't lock the rule only a so you can press f4 it will lock it for you and you remove this dollar sign from this too that's the only thing you need to do so if you can recall and i'm worrying we lock the row uh the row yeah one we lock the row one but here we lock the word a2 because that's where this is so we want the a2 to change we want the uh rows to change things we have that three uh a set of uh information that we need to extract from one channel so this is what you are going to do so the next thing uh what you are going to do just hold control hold control and press enter so you will see the whole data type appear and so just press hold control and press enter so now we got everything data in moment type to look at the index zero so definitely babu uh data babu information awarding the index zero babu information awarding that what is telling so here it is this is it so now we extract these three the information they have uh, first name so name date of birth gender marital status address date lg and phone number we extracted everything now out of this Kapat then we extracting what the information from this so these are the information uh, related to these uh, people so for that of birth all you need to is just to check format it to let's see just short date you'll see it now is the date of birth uh, as you are seeing it so this is the formula and uh, when they began Eva, you can just uh, watch the video and inshallah it will help you again. Or oh, I think let me repeat it again. The Saudi, Sabuda Aragani, Sabuda Mutani, so Ara Fahim Tawana formula in Harzuaka. First, you need to uh, put the headings here, come on, Nachi Horko. Then you need to highlight all the cells, empty cells, and like it's okay, and train data in. Just highlight them. So after you highlight them, just press equals to and write index open bracket your array is the whole data just go and take the whole data here it is just highlight the whole data as you can see highlight it all and just lock it by pressing f4 o function key f4 that is f n f4 so just press f4 join you put comma so the row number we don't have row number so we need to apply match formula in order for us to get the row number Make sure if you didn't watch my index match formula, I did a video about data analysis. Watch that video. I explain more about uh, index match uh, formula. So just write match. So the lookup value we are looking for now is the what? Is the this 
this number that is the staff code so just click on this staff code and lock it but what you need to lock is only the word you need to lock the column not the row because we want the row to change so just remove the dollar sign uh, uh before two like this the way i did it like this just remove it before two then you put comma what is the lookup array that you are looking for is this we are looking for uh the the whole uh staff code so just click on this and highlight the whole row of staff staff codes 78,000 of them so just lock them you need to lock them then you put comma then you put zero because we want the exact match so you put zero then you close it so now immediately after you close it then you put comma what you need to apply again is the match formula in order for you to get uh the column uh number that you want to select data from so we need to apply match so see as a match then you open bracket what is the lookup value for the match the first one you are looking for is the first name so lock it but now what you want to lock is the what is the column you want to lock now the uh yes the row not the column now that what you want to lock so just remove dollars and before b and lock the word row because you want everything to stop at row one so just leave the row one leave the dollar sign before one so just put comma the lookup array is what is the headings of this so just highlight the heading up till this and lock it then you put comma then you put zero you close the two brackets then let's go back to our data here it is then you hold control and you press enter that's all uh, sorry you hold control and you press enter that's all you got your data so this is how we extract specific data out of bulk data using uh, Excel go in Excel using index match functions so on the big area this is like a long video but inshallah we'll see you in the chicken I can do okay now Excel one day I will know you know we should say I have series then I can Excel 51 videos then you can watch them I have uh, separate videos in a data analysis Excel you can watch them also that you can catch up with this uh, video the uh, inshallah the battle Allah like a samurai والسلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته